All right. Today, I am going to be using the double dagger and crossbow loadout that is pretty overpowered. Probably one of my best loadouts, if not my best. But I'll show you what these things do. Not the avatar, loadouts. We go to sidearm, and it should be. Okay, 68 fire damage plus criticals. That is very nice. Um, both fire and criticals are pretty good perks to have on the weapon. Then we've got the 70 fire damage, so a little bit more damage, um, but monster damage, then it's fire damage, but monster damage is basically useless um, because the monsters, I believe those are the zombies, and zombies are super easy to kill no matter if you have the perk or you don't. Um, but here we got the ice uh, crossbow with plus reload. Plus reload is probably the best perk, especially when you get at level 50, because um, then you got seven shots. As you can see here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pretty overpowered. Let me just do a little quick reload. And yeah, this is probably my favorite loadout, and I will show you how it works with my nice little loadout. Or, I guess that's, that's not my loadout, that's my, my customization. Um, how I look cool doesn't affect my loadout but I also got the exosuit perk of impale which adds 40% chance to increase damage by 200% the bow and crossbow damage but so basically I can get about a thousand shots or a thousand damage per second with shooting very fast and reloading very fast um, but you know you gotta hit your shots too but then I have the mine perk plus gold uh, reward end game by 20%. Uh, we've got the vitality recover health every 3.33 seconds and haste increase movement speed by 50%. Basically everything to make you more powerful. Um, the gold doesn't really, but I like having more gold and the other mind perks don't really do much benefit for me. So that's what I do. Here we're gonna go to the uh, vile halls because I don't think I've really made videos in the Vile Halls much before to get that green tint. And this, a little bit of an easy dungeon, so I might be done this in like five minutes flat, but I'll, I'll try to milk it a little bit. Um, we'll do this one with the hardest difficulty. Uh, I don't think I'm ever going to really record on anything less than the hardest. We'll see. Maybe I will. Who knows? Um, but I do like... The hardest difficulty the best even though it doesn't give you better rewards for the hardness so if you really just want to grind and level up you do not want to do the hardest you just want to do the easiest oh excuse me wow. there we've got my creepy little face nice stuff all right so i'm gonna open this to start us off give us that lever hold that go on down as it goes down we both of these okay awesome so i do not like the frozen chests uh anymore at least i loved them to start uh but now that i have collected all of the customizable um all of the stuff by the way i gotta turn this down a little bit Woo. i had it like blasting volume all right so, here we will see how amazing, let me finish that guy off, how amazing the bow can be. I'm going to use it oh, against the really tough guys. Oh, jeez, do we have a guy behind us? We do. Oh, this might not be good. I might actually die here. Oof. I was taking it light, taking it too light. Oh, I just missed my shot and hit another. Okay, dudes, stop hitting your shots. Come on, man don't appreciate oh okay where are we at a little low. oh my gosh i have 88 health how i feel like i've gotten hit by everything but i still have like unlimited health here let's do a jump kill Ugh. that was pretty weird looking um oh i was definitely aimed at that guy but it just decided to take out the zombie instead 50 percent i guess wow it is really hard to melee. There we go. Especially with the knives. Sometimes. But you can you can poke a decent amount. Sometimes do some good stuff with poke. Oh, poke. Come on. Come on. There we go. Still 100 health. That's crazy. 
All right, well, we got locked in that room um, while we were fighting. Yep, kill that. Give me my knife back. And sometimes I'll loot like this, but I don't need the potions anymore. Uh, actually, I never really do. Let's see if I can break the vase with the potion. Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. So, yeah, <laughs> it can be kind of fun trying to break a vase without the aim assist of the weapons that you naturally get. I'm going to open that while I defeat these dudes. Okay, come on now. You're dodging, dodging my throws. Oops, thought I had something in my hand and I didn't. Okay, cool. Always try to kill these flying guys first because they can be the biggest nuisance. Um, here we go. Ah, there we go. Just had to hit that one down. And you can see, very easy to kill these guys. You can bop them on the head after they're frozen. Oh, wow, I thought I thought I hit that shot. I thought I would have hit that shot. Let's see if we can get a frozen. Wow, seven shots and I didn't get a frozen. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, see, these purple guys, sometimes they don't take the, they don't get frozen by the perk. Um, so that can be pretty spooky. That time <laughs> I had the frozen Burke and he just died immediately instead of getting frozen first. Okay, yeah. Sometimes I just aim right above their head and do not end up shooting them. Okay, I say go right to start here. Oh, that's where I came from. Oops. Um... I do like going right though, so we'll go to this one, which is right of where we came. And we do have a place. Oh, it glitched me out a little bit there, so I didn't really see. Okay, dude, stop dodging. What? That's crazy. It went right through him. Bop. Oh, jeez. I did not really think that through. Didn't realize that barrel was an explosive barrel. I didn't look too hard at that. Okay, it's glitching me out here a little bit. Hard to peek in here when you're a little, a little glitched. I don't actually really understand what's going on here, but I think I saw a level three chest in there. Oh, bye knife. Okay, we got a level three in there, so I definitely have to find a key. I feel like there is sometimes a crate that has a key um surprised uh, the the mobs haven't dropped keys yet but i don't think there's any keys the zombies are by the way are really easy to kill with the knives because you can kind of just as long as you throw it in the general height of your head it's gonna it's gonna hit their heads um because there's a little bit of aim assist on the melee throwing mechanics okay Please give me keys. I feel like sometimes there's keys in these little cubbies here. Nope, no keys. We're getting quite unlucky. Don't want that to explode on us. Oh, wow. Right as I was saying the aim assist helps, I just miss all of my headshots. Okay. And with the daggers, they can be nice, but especially against those blocking fellers, um... <laughs> They block basically all of your throws if you're trying to hit their heads. Uh, so that's when it is good to switch over to the crossbow, especially if you're in a bit of a tough situation. Or you can uh, switch over to meleeing them like that. Um, but mainly that's just when there's one of them. It's a lot easier to handle. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's really, really loving glitching me out here. But I do realize that that was a level 3 chest as well. Um, just from looking real quick at it, I could tell. Uh, which is pretty nice. This is a small dungeon with two level 3 chests. However, I have only found one key so far that is not even in my inventory. I just remember that there's a key right here. Okay, so we've got that key. Hopefully, in this final room here. I can find a couple more keys. Usually there's some on the uh, the edges up here. I'm just like starting it without even really knowing what I'm getting myself into. 
but because I have the bow, the crossbow, that's super overpowered, um, I don't need to worry one bit, especially because <laughs> you have last stand as well, so even if you die, you probably won't be dead. But yeah, so I have two keys now. That's pretty good. Let's see if I can kill these guys. Ooh, wow. Okay, this guy fell down, but he's not down down. Yeah, see, these guys are just never going to die. So I'm just going to pull out my overpowered weapon to kill him here. There we go. Very, very light work. Um, because they just dodge and dodge and, and take the shots. Oh, my goodness. Dang, and one shot just like really puts you down. 25 health, that's crazy. Oh man, if you really were restricted to melee only, this would be <laughs> nearly impossible. Ugh. Depending what weapon you have. Um, I would say the daggers are probably the hardest to melee with. Um, sometimes like the clubs can be pretty hard because they're so big. They get blocked a lot easier. Oh, wow, I just jumped by accident. Come on, dude. Die. Oh, hell. 50. Let's take the easy way. Bam. Perfect. <laughs> uh, really, you can just you can fall back on that. Oh, my goodness. It's crazy how little damage that does. Nice. All right, let me get this little pack of gold over here. Maybe there's a key down here that I did not know of. Nope. Um, I feel like this place should always have a key. I'm. I didn't even notice this was under here. I could have been looking for that for ages. But here we go. Um, I added two of the three. Apparently, there's one more battery. But I'm gonna go back and open one of these chests over here because there were two tier threes but i only have enough for one because i have oh no that sucks <laughs> it's a, a frozen tier two tier three. Oh, okay well, well we'll just see what we got invisibility great santa's cane great oh man that could have been so nice if it was uh... a <laughs> non-frozen tier three that's okay that's okay we won't mind i've got plenty of tier threes in my future um i do have to find that last uh battery which i'm just i'm holding my grip button and just hoping that it comes into my hand because i don't know where it dropped i might have killed it over here i could have killed it up here i accidentally got some gold from that uh-oh I do not know where it is. This is not good. Um, hmm. It's gotta be in the sewage somewhere, is my guess. But like, I don't see. We're just gonna do a zigzag. Huh. Oh. Wow, I'm really stupid. That was three out of three. I already had them. Oh, man. What am I doing? What am I thinking? <laughs> All right. Well, that was the dungeon. And super simple. One weapon module. Not amazing. Got some, some stuff. Levels already there. And, yeah. Again, I, I this was not my hottest... Hottest dungeon, I did not feel the best doing this dungeon, but nevertheless, we always could fall back on this reload crossbow here because it is ice, which is the best perk, and it is a crossbow with plus reload, which I guess, I guess the plus reload is probably the best perk, but the ice is the best uh, element perk, but yeah, there we go. Peace out.